you use eSports as the passion, as the hook, as the vehicle to bring in the students. And then you teach them transferable skills that, that, that broaden their horizon. I get to learn skills whilst playing eSports, whilst doing the fun things, making friends, learning soft and hard skills and really building my repertoire of, of arsenal to, to go off into a university or the job place. That's... So eSports isn't just for professional gamers, it's really important to understand that eSports are for people who have a passion and an interest in this industry that's worth 1.2 billion, right? It is so accessible to all of our students. Um, it's full of team building, communication, problem solving and logistics, all these great skills that you can take into employment. And of course it's about people who've got an interest in gaming, whether that's competitive, whether they want to become pro, or they just want it for escapism and enjoyment. The, the positive uh, dividends, dividends and benefits that come from it are really well known and we fully encourage people to look into that more and get behind this wonderful curriculum and, and esports industry. The, the last few years have been difficult for everybody and we've seen unprecedented times, especially in education. And actually what eSports does is it, it provides us with the opportunity to truly transform lives and hook into something that is growing, that is so creative and that people are so passionate about. And then through that passion that they have for eSports, we can then get through all of the key knowledge around business, around media, around sport but then also the transferable skills and the behaviours to prepare them for the next steps. We never say to students it's a gaming course. It isn't. It's about the industry and it's about getting those kids ready for employment. That's why you should teach eSports because it's a massively growing industry but it's an industry that's untapped and loved by many and taught by not enough at the moment.